but I look like close up. I just wanted to get you a little bit closer. It, it's beautiful. It's like, I feel like so nice with this on you guys. It is a beautiful essence. Like I look so good. Even with the darkness here, it looks good. Okay guys, so let's get started on the video. I was able to get my hands on this new CoverGirl Simply Ageless Skin Perfector Essence. It kind of looks like the Chanel Essence. Um, these are just like encapsulated pigment. So this is what it looks like. I did get the deepest shade. I'm just going to read to you guys. Um the skincare benefits because there are some skincare benefits that to be honest with you this may be a better choice in terms of this kind of formula because of the skincare benefits in this one i did not see when i looked up the chanel version of this i did not see as many skincare benefits so these are the claims to fame i'm reading from my phone it contains 0.5% Bakuchi oil and transamatic acid. Now, everybody says that Bakuchi oil is a substitute for retinol. It is not. When I looked at, looked it up, and also Dr. Dre, who is a, dermat a board-certified dermatologist on YouTube, she made a video about this and basically confirmed it is not a substitute for retinol. It is a... Um, antioxidant it is good for your skin but it's definitely not a, a substitute for retinol so it will brighten just like transamabic um, acid it is a brightener so over time your skin from using this particular product will brighten up it comes with a pump thank god that's all i care about like as long as the product comes with a pump i'm happy you get about one full ounces i am in the i picked up the the deepest shade which is an espresso and then i'm gonna tell you there's one two three four five six seven eight shades um and most of these when they make these products now a lot of these sh shades are flexible in terms they would fit multiple skin shades so i'm not so upset about that and i like the fact that they had this deep of a skin tone this is, might be a little darker for me but i don't mind doing that because it matches my neck so i'm just gonna pump a little bit in here so this is what it looks like you guys oh it's very watery I should have just pumped it in my hand, but I'm just going to do this. We're going to do that. I'm going to, oh, this is super light, you guys. I have some breakouts. I did not bring a, this is really, not... it feels like a serum. It really feels like a serum. Okay, guys, I had to switch y'all to another angle because I was I couldn't see myself. I was trying to give y'all some cute background. I'm just back in my office right now. It's it's okay because I'm gonna redo the background. Anyway, you guys, this is absolutely gorgeous. It's look at my skin. It's like I don't have nothing on but like it gave me a little bit of coverage it's like literally skincare so um it looks really good this has been on my skin for about 10 minutes it looks really good i actually don't want to really do too much i think what i'm gonna do i'm gonna use this nars uh concealer i'm just gonna put a little bit right here i'm not gonna put too much this isn't chocolate I got this in PR. I, I, I used to buy this, this concealer all the time. This actually used to be my concealer and then like I stopped using it. I'm just going to put a little bit in here. This is a BK Cosmetics brush. I kind of like it. Um, however, um, I would be careful with this if you have a lot of lines like me. I'm not gonna do too much. I'm just gonna, I just wanna conceal my under eyes. 
that looks good. And I'm gonna like set it with a little bit of powder. I, I usually use a beauty blender, but um, I just, this is why I use a deeper um, foundation, you guys, now. Because it just looks so much better. And like I said, it matches my neck good. And I take care of my neck. I was trying to get my neck. Okay, guys. So I wasn't able to finish um, getting ready with you guys. But I just wanted to show you the finished product. I still do have a little bit of darkness here. But I really don't mind it. Uh, I just put a little concealer under my eye. You know what, you guys? If you're looking for a really natural makeup with no makeup look, this is for you. It is absolutely beautiful. I'm just going to... I have some sinus issues, you guys. I'm just going to dump a little bit in my hand just to show you how it really works. Like, it, it is so beautiful, you guys. Like... So that's what you get. It's a little deeper for me, like I said, but I that's what I've been doing lately. It is like skincare. It is absolutely beautiful. And it. I didn't even set it. I just let it dry naturally. And I'm going to see how it behaves. If it doesn't behave well, I'll set it with some powder. But I'm not going to do that now. And I just put some blush on, some concealer. I'll leave everything below. But if you're looking on those days where you're not trying to be complicated in your look, get this. I'm telling you, get it. Anyway, I'll see you guys later. If you want to wear tests, maybe I might check in with you guys. I'll do maybe a separate video or I'll check in with you guys to let you know. I'm just having some camera issues right now, but I wanted to really get this video up. I'll see you guys later.